begin the vlog with letting y'all know I'm starting another leg of my life right now. And I got rid of all of my distractions, anything that was in my way that was hindering me from doing what I was trying to do and being the man that I'm going to become. And this is the beginning of it. But you know, of course I had to party and purge and shit in the process. So I didn't vlog. I'm not going to vlog that. I'm just going to start this with me at the airport. I'm headed to Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. And it's on and popping. So the spine lady recommended the meatballs. And they are great. Can you see them? Yeah, you can see them. They're great. I would order a margarita, but I already uh, had some drinks on my way to the airport. So, man, but I'm real, I'm real happy right now. I'm in a real good space, and I know this is the beginning of a really good journey for me because I'm the one that planned the journey, and I pretty much prayed about it. And then I made, God put me in a position to make pretty much all of those, answer my prayers pretty much, you know what I'm saying? Every single one of them. So I know that the position that I'm currently in is the right position and I'm making all the right moves because everything I prayed for is happening. So I'll get back with y'all in a minute. This is the quietest airport I've ever been in my life. Look at this, this is the ride here. Look at this, empty, waiting for my Uber. Crazy. You know if you like Houston, Miami or something, or Fort Lauderdale, LA, Dallas, it'll be packed. No matter what time it is, be cars everywhere, a bunch of people, Ubers and lifts backed up, but, not here. It's nice and quiet, peaceful. Well, I finally made it to my hotel. I love being in the Northeast. I, I, I guess this is considered the Northeast. But they always got indoor pools in the hotels. And they always got indoor pools in the hotels. I love it. Whether it's in the Midwest or the Northeast, East Coast, stuff like that, where it's snow real heavy. They always got indoor pools. And I love being in the pool. I'm trying to be talking about the hallway. So I'm going to check out. Ooh, my door was open. I don't really care. Somebody be in trouble if they was in here lurking. So, look around anyway, just in case I gotta book somebody. And it's cold too. So, this is the room. Just something regular and basic. I'm only be here for, in this room for a night. So. I ain't really tripping. As long as the bed is nice, neat, clean, no bed bugs, stuff like that. I'm cool with it. And as long as the bathroom is clean. And it is just some regular shit. So I'm about to actually go take a walk. Everything is closed. It's freezing out here. 
But everything is closed. So I'm gonna go to 7 Eleven just grab me some fruit, something. It's nice and brisk out here. That's the hotel back there. I haven't been in cold weather in a while. It's not really cold, it's just like. It's a little chilly. It ain't bad. Look, got rabbits running around. It's, the weather's cool, it feels good. Cause I haven't been in car, been in the heat for so long. So, go to this 7-Eleven, grab me some water, cause they got a gym. And just some stuff to snack on. It's kind of late, it's like almost one o'clock in the morning, so. I gotta get a phone case for this, for this phone, cause it's a brand spanking new phone and I am not trying to break it or crack my screen. But it feel good out here. I'm probably hit, I ain't gonna probably, I'm for sure gonna hit the gym in the morning time. Hit the gym in the morning time. Get up about 6 a.m. Get cracking. Then have me some breakfast. So, I don't think I gotta go take care of no business until later on in the day. Probably like 5 p.m. or something. I'm gonna see how far Philly is. Might Uber to Philly for the night. Go hang out and see what's going on. Matter of fact, I know some people out here in Harrisburg. We own a. We own a. Um, uh, a hookah lounge some Indian guys I met last time I was in Harrisburg real cool people let me hit him up see if they open it's kind of late but last time I was there it was late as hell too we didn't leave there till like 3 in the morning we was hammering too me and Mike let's see what I want Maybe I'll just give me a little sandwich. Or a salad, I'm gonna get a salad. Let's see where the salad is there. Got me chicken salad sandwich, some fruit, some nuts, chips, water it's gonna be dinner for the night so just woke up slept in a little bit today because i deserve to I'm about to go downstairs get some breakfast and then hit the gym and then Call my business associates. I'm gonna sleep at like 2 30, 3 o'clock in the morning. My brain just be racing sometimes. But I don't mind. Let's see what kind of food they got here. Pretty basic hotel food. Some basic hotel food. Bacon, eggs, waffles, cereal, fruit, toast. So I just got finished eating breakfast. I'm about to find a gym so I can just at least see what it looks like. Let's see what they got in there. I don't got nothing in there. I still know how to get it in. I don't think it's this way for some reason. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. Let's see what they got. I was watching TikTok and they were saying Is that those that bacon, that pre cooked bacon? Like the little thin strips that become already cooked. 
They said that's dog. And we don't know the difference because it tastes like pork. Who will? Hey, I got a question. Where's the gym? The gym. Gym? The gym? No. <laughs> yes. <laughs> there. There. Okay. Thank you. Yeah. She's pretty as hell. No English. Say? Maybe it's down here. Oh, yeah. Fitness center. Let's see what they got in there. Guess I'll just be on a treadmill. Oh, they got a nice indoor pool. Mm -hmm. Nice indoor pool. <laughs> Little gym, they don't have no weights in the gym though. I'm gonna just be on the treadmill. Whatever I gotta do to keep me in. I'm with that. I'm gonna go back to my room real quick. Put on a little workout outfit, workout shoes. So I just woke up from my nap. And I decided to get out. I'm gonna go over here to watch a little bit of the game and have some drinks, probably a couple appetizers or something. Cause I'm just one of them people, I just can't, I don't know. I can't just sit inside, I like to be outside. And it's cold, but I ain't been in the cold in so long. It feel good. And I got my trusty, polo jacket it's snow proof wind proof and it's pretty thin my hoodie on under this so i'm nice and snuggled up and the restaurant ain't far it's just on the other side of this parking lot which is on the other side of the hotel so it's crazy like when i be out of town and stuff like that or all white towns and stuff you know a lot of black people be like Man, you gotta watch out for them racist white people. Man, I've been all over America in the most hickest towns, the smallest town, population a thousand people. They all white, raised there. They hold generational lineage from there. And I've always been treated good. I think it's because of my personality. I'm a people person. So I have a real warm and inviting personality. So, everywhere I go, I have a good time. So I'm gonna go here and have a good time. And I'm not a scary dude either. I'm a pretty tough guy. I've been through a lot of stuff in my life and survived it all. So, I feel comfortable in any environment. No matter where I'm at, I don't care who hood it is, I don't care what's going on. I'm very comfortable in any environment because I know I'd tear something up if I need to. But being comfortable in every environment allows me to enjoy myself in any environment and make the best out of things. I'm a real positive guy too. I always see the bigger picture and I always see the opportunity in things. I don't look at nothing as a negative. Everything is a positive for me to learn, grow, or profit or benefit from, no matter what the situation is. All right, I'm here now. Can I run this way? So Carl Sheffers will sort this one out. Headed back to the room right now. I'm gonna go check and see how warm that indoor pool is. They said the room is heated and the pool is heated. So I'm sure it's probably like 80 degrees in there. I have four margaritas. I'm gonna relax in the pool. 
the pool right here. In there. It says it's only three feet, four feet, five feet. Yeah. That's cool. I just want to relax anyway. Yes. <laughs> I had four margaritas and some uh, boneless wings. How many margaritas? Four. Okay, thank you. You drank one for me? Yes. <laughs> so I'm going to go lay in the pool. I love the pool, the beach, all of that. I'd rather run up a flight of three, three flights of stairs than to wait for this elevator. Goodness. Yeah, but I love the pool and the beach. That's why I like being up here. I'm up here to take care of some business, so I'm in the North, well, I'm in Pennsylvania, and up this way to Midwest, East Coast, I noticed that all of their hotels have indoor pools. I love that. You can't beat it. And they always open year round. Excuse me. Sorry about that. <laughs> I'm going to take advantage of it. Well, I'm feeling saucy. I know they ain't in my room. I could have sworn I put my. Oh, no, they're not. Let me get dressed for the pool. Catch y'all out there. So I finally made it out to the pool. I thought it was gonna be a lot warmer, but it's not. But it's cool though. me a few laps. Probably stay out here for like an hour. And then call it a night. Because I want to get up early. That was a good swim. It was just a little chilly. I wasn't expecting the pool, since it's an indoor pool, I wasn't expecting it to be so cold, but I still had a good time. It wasn't cold as it could have been if that thing was outside. So, I still appreciate it, I had a good time. <sighs> Swim, a couple of laps. Got some cardio in. So, now I'm about to take me a shower. Relax. I know my vlog, this vlog is going kind of piece by piece, kind of short, but I don't care. I'm getting back acclimated into vlogging again. I have to be comfortable vlogging in public and stuff around people. I done popped me a Benadryl. Helped me get to sleep a little early. Plus, I got allergies, too. But I'm about to call it a night. Get up early. Hit the gym. Have some breakfast. Start my day. <laughs> so, 
I'll catch up with y'all on the next one.